Hey, welcome back. We're over here now in Lamentations chapter 5, verses 4 to 6 is our reading, and we'll read it, and then we'll think about it a little bit together. We pay for the water we drink, and our wood comes at a price. They pursue at our heels. We labor and have no rest. We have given our hand to the Egyptians and to the Assyrians to be satisfied with bread. So again, we're at chapter 5 of Lamentations. This is a chapter that begins to look at restoration. The people have been so humiliated and so humbled at this point that they're starting to come back. But here we're still kind of seeing their abject feeling of desolation and aloneness. But through that arrival of that feeling, God is able to begin to reach them again. So we pay for the water we drink. That's a pretty grim situation to be in, isn't it? Even your own water that you used to get for free out of the, out of the stream or out of the well, now you've got to pay some foreigner for the water. This is the picture of, of people who are oppressed and desolate and have no material wealth whatsoever. They're scrambling to survive. If they find a raisin, they're happy. Okay, so these people have a lot of trouble. They have, their nation forsook God, forsook his protection. God allowed desolation to come to them. And now they're beginning to remember him. We pray that we won't have to learn hard lessons like Judah did, uh, but often we do, often we do. So what's the lesson here? What's going on in our reading? Jeremiah the prophet, who's writing this book of Lamentations prophetically, Jeremiah is putting a word there to every reader and to God himself. Your medicine, O oh God, is working. Your people are humbled. We are desolate. We are recognizing our need, and now all the things we know we used to trust our win, our win, the wealth we had, and all these different wealthy things, all that has gone away, and we're beginning to see much better now our need for the God of heaven. How much better things were when there was some degree of faithfulness to God. We need to come back to God's values, and he'll get us through. Let's pray. Dear Father in heaven, please be our helper. Watch over us. Be our God. Let us be your people and deliver us, first of all, from ourselves. And we trust in you, and we want to seek you first, Lord. You will bring every other thing we need, every other needful thing to pass. We know it's true, and we, we love you for it. We find it a bit challenging sometimes to serve you, but that's not on you, Lord. That's on us. Help us to grow in our spirituality. Help us to receive the good things you have for us and the disciplines you have for us. Now, Lord, we thank you for hearing. In Jesus' name, amen. God is on our side. He really is. And he'll be on your side today. God be with you.